So from an initial $4,000 investment to 40 grand a year, is it bad? Especially as it only takes up six hours a week. However, we can do better. And the only way to do that without buying even more machines is to get bigger, better locations. So today, that's exactly what we're doing. We're going location hunting, collecting and restocking my machines. I'll update you on my toys from China, and I'll even take you to bouldering and basketball to boot. All the bees. Roll intro. <laughs> So, like I said in the intro, I built the company from a $4,000 investment up to 40 grand a year. What we need now is bigger, better locations. Hello there. <laughs> My pizza shop location is just up the road and just a little bit further from that it's an absolutely massive indoor vintage market which would be a fantastic place to put one of my mini claws. I'm off to go and speak to the manager Jasmine and fingers crossed they want one of my machines. Come on. everything from retro clothes to artwork and it's just filled with the right demographic for London they're kind of 18 to 25 year olds you just got fingers crossed and we can get one of my machines in here let's take a look around As you can probably tell by the huge bags under my eyes, it's been another late night chatting back and forth with suppliers in China and getting very little sleep and quite stressed. I was expecting our brand new toys this week, but as probably a lot of you know, there's been a lot of shipping issues and they have been delayed. But it's a beautiful day. There's collections to be had. But before then, I need to blow off some steam and get rid of some of this Christmas weight around the belly. So I'm off climbing because it's been far too long.
folks, it has been a good first year, but we can and will do better. And don't you worry, I will take you with me every step of the way as I build my business. And we get into the choicest of locations. <laughs> I just realised how many more pitches to locations that means. But it's fine. It's all part and parcel of the job. Oh, before I forget, the lovely Nathan from Nathan's Vendings had me on his podcast this week. And you can check the video version of that over on his channel. Links below where you can hear me waffle on even more about my first year in business. But head over there, give his channel a sub because he's a hardworking lad. All right. Until next time, happy gaming. <laughs> <laughs> That's what happens when you edit with music. Get stuck in your head like. <sighs>